Okay, right. Let me just kind of just get yourself set up for this anyway, stuff part anyway. So yeah, just wanna um whoever's listening to me now or gonna be listening to me later, you know, um I think you know, um, you know, um I don't know what it is with um with, with, with questions we're so pc that we um kind of forget that um we need to have a voice and it's important that you know we talk how we feel we could be wrong we could be right but it seems to be people just think that christians meant to have no opinion about anything anyway so yeah but anyway so yeah but this is my opinion anyway so yeah everyone knows roger is not very opinionated um is that the truth <laughs> nah nah that's not the truth but anyway right so justin bieber Bought out a great little EP, dropped and woke everybody up over Easter. Like, whoa, 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 whoa. And it is part of a catalogue of albums that are EPs that have been released by artists that are not actually gospel artists. And it created up a bit of a stir and a bit of a conversation in, 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 in with, with the presenters and, and people going, okay, what's right to listen to, what's the wrong to. Now, listen, guys, you know, I've been around it for a while. I'm not really a fan of um of 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 like you know what I mean loading up and pushing up um artists that are doing gospel music um who are not Christians. Uh but the good thing about this what is for me for Justin Bieber, I believe that you know he's professing Christian and at the same time you, you might think, okay, what was that last track about? You know, there is that part of things, but um the reality show is you know it brought out a body of work, a number of works which you can see there's somebody kind of stepping over you know what I mean and actually really keeping it real you know what I'm saying and utilizing this platform to to produce a message which is a strong message and I see Christian artists and it created a debate because people then were saying oh, hold on a second now still yeah do you need to be um do you need to be as a Christian artist be overtly Christian and I think okay you know you don't actually you know you're not gonna go to hell over it you know what i mean if you want to blend into what everyone else is saying but we had to show is that yo we just had a thing like little nas last week he ain't blending he's just saying as it is and you, you, we spent so much effort in blending in that you know what for me my personal opinion this is not us save the lord I just think there's a season where artists have brought out bodies of work who are not Christians, the Kanye West, the um, the PJ Mortons, the Justin Bieber's, who are not like real class as bone and fried Christian artists. And the thing that body works are actually are theologically more correct than most of the body of works I see coming out of the UK gospel scene right about now. Yes, Roger said that. <laughs> <laughs> so um yes i do really fundamentally believe that we need to study to show yourself approved but at the same time i'm just, I, i'm just shouting out stuff if i want to i want to celebrate you know christian artists that are overtly christian 100 percent. you know I me mean? the guys who are just trying not to be overtly christian do your thing and just go, go out there don't moan that you don't get support from christian don't moan that you don't get support by anybody else because we have to show is there is no great model of that success there's nobody out there setting the example one thing i know is you do you you'll break barriers yeah that's all i'm saying do you you know what i'm saying but one thing i would say um is that you know what still you're just a bit what i a kind of nice product and you know what some of people said oh I, I, I may need to get the guitar out and and go back into listen man i'll tell you straight right about now ain't no one getting a guitar out with justin Bieber, man they're just gonna be like yo drop the vibes bro drop the vibes you know what i'm saying listen to his ep his ep is really really cool um i can't believe what you're saying that man listen to justin bieber like <laughs> baby baby oh that track i don't think justin bieber but you know what god is just doing amazing things in these times you know what i mean when we shut up trust me the stones are the stones are making up noise so we salute you and we're begging for great bodies of work and this is a, a great body of work man so I salute you justin the, the presenters are raving about it i know i've beaten lady t to play out on the radio uh, out there on the radio i don't know who beat me probably mellow beat me i think on monday um so I'm kind of vexed with that story anyway. but i'm thinking one of the one of the first fresh you know as 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 fresh prince of uh affinity extra you know i'm first to play it and i have to salute um um people that you know into this so in this time that we're in they know what they need to reflect and what needs a message they need to put out there so for me in this time it in doming down the message that really what we should be doing right by now let's proclaim that's all i'm saying let's start proclaiming 
I'm pointing out there. That's just, that's where I'm at, man. I'm not saying you, sh- guys. I'm not saying it's a heaven hell issue. You know what I'm saying? That's just, you know I me. Mean? I'm just saying. Let's proclaim. That's all I'm saying, dudes. Yo, this is Roger over there. We're gonna listen to this track. It's called All She Wrote. Anyway, so yeah, there's pure. There's, you know, old man and go. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. She wrote this. She wrote this. But anyway, enjoy this vibe of this track because it reminds me of um the mo- the you know the chord progression. Which reminds me of the back in the day R and B. We ain't got enough R and B. R and B show coming up very soon on Affinity Extra with your boy. No, not Roger Moore. <laughs> yeah. We reject what we don't.